So this beautiful lady right here with the horns and the classic Texas red and white pattern. This is my girl Brisket. Brisket is my first stewardship story. When I got here and moved in with my wife and her kids, she told me that when the kids were young, they didn't want to eat brisket. So I was like, what the fuck are we going to do with this bitch then? Fucking pasture ornament. And I just gave it to God. And, you know, I said, hey, let me know what needs to be done with that one. And I didn't think anything of it for a long time. Fast forward a few years, I met this guy, and he was a kook, man. He was a crazy dude. He used to fly helicopters for the, for the U.S. Army. Retired as a sergeant major. He's a goofy dude, bro. And that's how I ended up with that Wagyu bull to the left of Brisket. And that's how I ended up with Zeta, my first cow, and Daddy's Little Cutie, my second cow there. And God's really fascinating, right? Like, he loves his fucking metaphors, doesn't he? Because I didn't know at the time that I was going to start some fucking stewardship journey. I didn't know at the time what he had in store for me. But I just promised I'd take care of her, you know? I'd do, I'd do right by her. I started studying regenerative ag. All this fucking bald knob desert bullshit out here starting to turn green. Four and a half fucking years of blood, sweat, and tears. I don't have any fucking equipment. I've done this all by hand. And it's only been in the last two years that the kids have started helping me. It's only been in the last two months that my towny ass fuck neighbor who told me for fucking six years that, ah, you ain't no cattle man. Ah, you ain't no rancher. Ah, you ain't no farmer. Ah, you ain't no homesteader. Well, recently, this motherfucker started walking a lot. And he ain't walking for his health. He's walking to peek over my fucking fence. Because all the shit, everything out here is starting to turn green. Like, maybe I really did see the vision. Maybe I really did study. Maybe I really executed the plan. Three days ago, I traded him some steak and some eggs just to come out and actually use his fucking tractor. He did it wrong, but that's fine. Machine stamped, broad tolerances. Oh, Gokashi69, the snitch. That's my next stewardship story. I'll focus on Gokashi69 for y'all. Tell you his story. So, anyways, thanks for tuning in today. God bless.